Starting a craft blog can be an incredibly exciting and fulfilling endeavor, perfect for those with a deep passion for crafting and a desire to share their skills with the world. This comprehensive guide is designed to help beginners navigate the initial steps of setting up a successful craft blog, from choosing a niche to engaging with your growing audience. Whether you're into knitting, scrapbooking, woodworking, or any other form of crafting, this guide aims to provide you with the essential tools and knowledge needed to kickstart your blogging adventure. Choose your niche. The term crafts encompasses a vast array of activities, making it a broad category. By honing in on a specific niche, you can draw in a more dedicated and engaged audience. Let's examine 10 popular sub-niches of crafts, knitting and crocheting. This sub-niche includes patterns, techniques, yarn reviews, and tutorials for both beginners and advanced crafters. Scrapbooking and paper crafts. Encompasses creating memory books, handmade greeting cards, paper flowers, and other decorative items from paper. Sewing and quilting. Covers everything from making clothes and accessories to creating intricate quilts. Jewelry making. Involves creating necklaces, bracelets, earrings, and other jewelry items using various materials and techniques. Woodworking. This can range from small projects like birdhouses or coasters to larger furniture making. Upcycling and repurposing. Focuses on transforming old or discarded materials into new, useful, or decorative items. Pottery and ceramics. Involves the creation of decorative and functional items from clay. Candle and soap making. Covers the process of making homemade candles and soaps, including different scents and designs. Painting and drawing. While often considered more of an art than a craft, this sub-niche includes decorative painting on various surfaces, as well as illustrating for craft projects. Embroidery and cross-stitch. Involves decorative sewing and needlework on fabric. Contemplate whether your passion lies in general crafting or if you prefer delving into one or more of these sub-niches. Select a blogging platform. Numerous platforms are available for those looking to start a blog, including popular options like WordPress, Blogger, and Squarespace. Each platform offers unique features and varies in ease of use, customization levels, and support services. It's essential to thoroughly research and assess the pros and cons of each option to select the one that aligns best with your specific needs, preferences, and technical expertise, ensuring a smooth blogging journey. Set up your blog. Personalize your blog by selecting a theme that resonates with your unique style and the specific craft niche you are focusing on. It's crucial to ensure that your blog's layout is user-friendly and easily navigable, supports mobile viewing to accommodate all readers, and maintains a clean, uncluttered design. This approach will enhance the presentation of your crafts and projects, making them more appealing and accessible to your audience. Create quality content. In the world of blogging, content reigns supreme. Begin by crafting posts that not only inform, but also captivate and provide significant value to your audience. Consider writing detailed tutorials, sharing insider tips and tricks, reviewing the latest craft products, or chronicling your own craft project journeys. Enhance your posts with high-quality images and detailed step-by-step -step instructions to elevate the appeal and utility of your content, making it indispensable for your readers. Promote your blog. Leverage the power of social media platforms such as Instagram, Pinterest, Facebook, and Twitter to amplify your blog's reach and foster a connection with your audience. By actively posting, sharing content, and interacting on these platforms, you can significantly boost your blog's visibility. Additionally, engaging with fellow craft bloggers and joining crafting communities online can further enhance your presence and attract more followers to your blog. Engage with your readers. Make it a priority to respond to comments on your blog and all associated social media channels. By actively engaging with your audience, you cultivate a supportive community around your blog. This interaction not only strengthens your relationship with readers, but also serves as a rich source of valuable feedback and innovative ideas, which can significantly influence the content and direction of your future posts. Monetize your blog. 
when your blog begins to attract a consistent stream of visitors and you have a solid base of content, it's time to consider various monetization strategies. Options include engaging in affiliate marketing, where you earn commissions for promoting other people's products. You can create sponsored posts in partnership with brands. You can sell your own unique products or patterns directly to your audience. Or you can incorporate advertisements into your blog layout. Each of these methods offer a potential revenue stream to support your blogging journey. Consistency and improvement. Maintaining a regular publishing schedule is crucial for the growth and success of your blog. Consistently delivering new content keeps your audience engaged and coming back for more. Additionally, it's important to continuously seek improvement by analyzing feedback and blog analytics. This approach helps you understand your audience better and refine your content strategy to meet their needs and interests effectively. In summary, embarking on the journey of starting a blog requires both time and patience, as success does not happen overnight. It's essential to keep your focus on producing high-quality content that resonates with your target audience and fosters engagement. By maintaining this commitment and actively interacting with your readers, you will gradually cultivate a growing, loyal craft community around your new crafting blog. Thanks for watching.